Many of you were asking me which drive to choose, hybrid, hybrid plug-in, or electric. On this example of one model in three drive options, I will try to help you choose the right model for you. Hello from Auto Start Test and welcome to my first video tutorial. Why Kia Nero? Just because it is one of few models on the market that is offered in three drive variants, hybrid, hybrid plug-in, and fully electric. The base price for each version is quite different as the cost of traveling each subsequent mile. Let's check with each version of the Nero will be perfect for you. Let's take a look at the prices first. The basic version of the Kia Nero self-charging hybrid costs £24,855. The middle version will cost you £27,555. And for the most expensive, you are £29,555. And only the last version offers full LED headlights, except for daytime running lights that are standard on each version. The Kia Nero self-charging hybrid is equipped with 1.6 6 GDI petrol engine and a 1.56 kilowatt hour battery and a dual clutch automatic transmission. Kia Niro PHEV is a plug in hybrid car which can offer you driving in electric mode up to 30 miles. We have two versions of the equipment and the price of the basic version is £30,265. The price of the more expensive version is £31,945. Unfortunately, full LED lights are not available as standard for these two versions, at least for the moment. Kia Nero plug-in is also equipped with a 1.6 GDI petrol engine and a dual-clutch automatic transmission with a 8.9 kilowatt-hour battery. This is how it looks on the Kia website. And how does it look from the driver's side? I will start with the self-charging hybrid version. Kia promises fuel consumption up to 58.9 miles per gallon. Real fuel consumption in the combined cycle is 55 miles per gallon. Of course, using Eco Driving, you can reach a wine close to the one given by the manufacturer or even more. In Nero Plug-in, theoretically, we can reach up to 202 miles per gallon. My best result was 171 miles per gallon, but your miles per gallon result may vary depending on the distance and how often you will use use the EV mode, but more about that in a moment. Kia e Nero is a fully electric car. Kia promises 282 miles on a single charge, except that we can realistically make over 300 miles or 200 miles, depending on the speed, outside temperature, and distance of your trip. More about it in my review of Kia e Nero. Before I get into the specifics, I will only add that Nero, regardless of the type of drive, offers the same amount of space in the cabin for passengers and drivers. The only difference is the luggage compartment capacity. In the plug-in version, is smaller due to the additional batteries located under the boot floor. More details can be found in my video review of the Nero models, or links in the description under the video. Which Nero version should you choose? At the beginning, a bit of mathematics. Assuming that you drive 10,000 miles a year, you can spend around 800 pounds of fuel on Nero self-charging hybrid. Assuming that the average price of a 1 litre of petrol will cost £1.10. In Nero plug, in the same distance you will travel on average £220 using EV mode. The cost of driving 10,000 miles with e Nero will cost you £2 a year if you are living in Scotland, using public charges, or £185 when charging from your home socket. And how does it look in practice? All the details about the Nero self-charging hybrid will not change much from what I presented earlier. But what about Nero plug-in? The real average and cost may look completely different. If you do a maximum of 30 miles every day for 30 days a month theoretically by charging the battery from the home socket, you could only drive using EV mode with 171 miles per gallon.
However, driving 50 miles a day, your fuel consumption will be similar to the one I obtained in my review around 70 miles per gallon. In the case of the Nero plug-in, it all depends on how many miles a day you travel. If you make long distances, then you need to charge the battery every day to keep the best miles per gallon. But keep in mind that your battery in plug-in hybrid will take at least 3.5 hours to full charge. The basic price of the Kia Nero self-charging hybrid is £24,855, while the Nero plug-in is £30,265. The difference between hybrid and hybrid plug-in is £5,410. From £5,410, you can buy 4,918 litres of petrol that you could use to drive 60,000 miles in Nero self-charging hybrid. Assuming if you buy a new car and you you will be driving the car for five years with annual mileage of 10,000 miles, choosing the hybrid plug-in option will save you around £2,900 on fuel compared to the self-charging hybrid version. If you will be using only EV mode, but you'll still lose £2,500. Well, unless you choose the most expensive version, Nero Self Hybrid, for £29,555, then you will be able to say that you will be saving that money on petrol. The situation is completely different in the case of e Nero. The car costs £34,995. The difference from the cheapest version of Nero Hybrid is £10,140. The £10,140 is an average of 9220 liters of petrol, you can use this petrol while driving the Nero self-charging hybrid for around 110,000 miles. So the price difference would be coming back to you after over 11 years or 5 years making over 20,000 miles a year. Of course, assuming that you will charge your car only using free charging points, charging from a home socket, you will still have to pay £925 for five years of use. In this case, you would have to wait longer for a possible return on investment in the electric version. Does this mean that it's not worth buying the plug-in hybrid or the electric drive version? Absolutely not. Each of these drive versions is directed to a completely different group of customers. So if you don't like the idea of charging the car or looking for charger points, but you are looking for a cost-effective drive and your budget does not exceed £25,000, then the Nero self-charging hybrid will be perfect proposition for you. If you like the economical driving, but you're not convinced about fully electric cars and you use the car mainly for commuting and at the weekend you like to go somewhere further, also your budget is slightly over £30,000, then the Nero plug-in will will be the perfect choice for you. However, if you would like to say goodbye to petrol stations, your budget is over £35,000 and in addition your annual mileage is very high, for example you are a taxi driver, then you should choose e Nero. e Nero can surprise you in very positive ways. The car on short distances can recover all the energy needed to overcome this distance. More in my Kia e Nero review. I hope my video will help you make the right choice. Remember that each version also has different equipment and you probably won't find everything that e Nero offers compared to the basic version of Nero self-charging hybrid. In addition, remember that each version of Nero you need to add a service fee. I do not provide service prices because they vary depending on the dealer and location. And which Nero would you like to choose for yourself? If I had to choose, e Nero would be a perfect proposition for me. As usual, I'm waiting for your opinion in the comments section. Links to all my reviews of each version of Nero can be found in the description below the video. Time to say goodbye, thanks for watching, take care of yourself and your four wheels. See you next time.